all right guys what's going on so in this video I'm gonna show you guys how we can uh, renew a let's encrypt SSL certificate in a Bitnami stack uh, that is hosted on Amazon light sale instance all right so can be applied to other um, other um, I guess boxes stacks um, I'm sure the process is probably a little bit uh, same so anyway, so this process is manual, so we're gonna do all the steps manually ourselves. So the first thing you want to do is you want to start this in a screen session, uh, just to, um, you know, in case it times out. And I will uh, name it that. Okay, now that you have done, so let's find out these domains that we need to, I guess, um, how should I say? Um, I guess renew the certificate for. So we're going to type the main domain here uh, and it looks like probably we made a mistake some somewhere it should be cert bot not box sorry cool so as you can see it's going to list the domains here so I'm going to copy them here and then what I'm going to clear this out this command that you want to do is you're going to do cert bot and cert only and we're doing this manually, so we're gonna do manual, and I'm gonna do preferred challenge. So it's gonna give us uh, that challenge. Uh, we need to add a TXT record then in the um, in the DNS. So I'm gonna do dash D. So now you're just gonna paste your domains here one by one. So that's my first domain. So that's my now second domain. So I'm gonna paste this, those here. And then you want to do force dash renewal like that so let's make sure you got this command right okay so if you have 10 domains you're just going to do dash d the domains in this kind of order and make sure the naming is correct so i'm going to hit enter okay uh permission denied so we probably need to yeah i'm not root so i need to do sudo like that all right cool so uh, now it's going to say that it's going to track the IP just to make sure uh, we're good. All right, so after that, now at this point, I'll just uh, caution you, do not hit enter uh, because we need to now add a TXT record. Um, uh, we need to add a DNS TXT record in our, um, I guess, whatever the TXT records are on our server. So you want to copy this string. All right, so then we're gonna come back here to uh, the Amazon light sale, and then you're gonna come over here to domains and DNS. Uh, and then if you scroll up to the top, you're gonna see this DNS records tab. I'm gonna click on that. So here you can add a new record. I'm gonna scroll to the bottom, and as you can see, we have these previous uh, DNS records. So I'm gonna hit the edit button, uh, and then I'm going to remove the existing one and paste the new uh, text or the challenge and then I'm gonna hit save okay when that is done now you're gonna copy this line right here I'm gonna copy it then you're gonna come to this tool It's called MX toolbox um, uh, dot com okay the, the tool is called DNS uh, txt lookup so I don't know why it's not showing here but uh, I think you can do txt lookup dot aspx let's see yeah that's the tool uh, so you want to go txt lookup dot aspx and this we're going to paste that string the txt record string and I'm going to do txt lookup cool so let's see it found the it found both actually but the one we wanted was this one 94yhc so now that that has propagated you go back to the screen and then now here you can hit enter again Right, so now it's going to give you another txt record so you're going to do the same kind of deal copy this i'm going to come here and i'm going to copy from here i'm just going to wait for the verification all right cool so it's going to say congratulations the thing has been done blah 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 so now we're not done yet finally what you have to do is you have to you have to restart the, uh, I guess, services. So I can do sudo opt bitnami, and then there's a script, and we're just gonna do restart. I think that's the, or I, yeah, I think I'm gonna do stop. 
Okay, so stopping the services. Okay, and then we're gonna do sudo opt bitnami, same thing, start. You have to do this if you want the new certificates to take in effect. All right, so that's done. So now we're gonna go, uh, if I come here and look at the, uh, to do what is it, connection secure. So remember it was May 26th, right, before, and I'm just gonna force refresh this. So I think it's uh, command R on Mac. And if you go connection is secure, Aha, see, there you go, expires on Wednesday, August 7th. So that's it, guys. So in this uh, video, we learned how we can manually renew an SSL certificate.